Sorry for the wind noise. It's a little windy in this part of town. There's the big mall to our left. This is strip mall with Burlington Coke Factory over there that's still open. One, two, three out building mall things that are all vacant. And just love the inside. It's all insulation from the ceiling and roof leaks. We got two vintage stores in this place that are closed down. This is Circuit City here. It's been abandoned for a long time. I when did Circuit City go out of business? Throw a comment down there. What year? Look at that old school neon. That's cool. And all the peeling. But again, on this side, more old school neon. That's just that's just awesome. Nice big parking lot, hardly being used. There's some cars over here because there's an actually an open store. There's the Circuit City. There's the Circuit City. The windows are atrocious. Uh, you can't see anything. Barely lit way back there. So you can't see much inside. The windows are really bad. Cleaned off a little bit. I mean, you can't get past that one door. Sorry guys. It's kind of a busy area. You know, shoplifters will be prosecuted. There you have it. I wander around the back, but we're gonna walk down this way a tad. Show you what's at this end of the mall. See, Target's gone. It's now a Burlington Coat Factory. There's a Circuit City Staples. I'm assuming that's probably gone. And then Big Anchor Toys R Us. Now yeah, there's nothing open down at this end. All these shops here are vacant. Okay, here would be the Circuit City. There you go. Walk down a little way. Oh, lights are falling down. Absolutely nothing in there. It's another vacant one. It's actually got standing water on the floor. windows have tint on them. Again, that we're going to see much in there. Still some stuff in there. 
registers are in there. Wow. That's cool. All right, let's wander down the side of the building. Most of the signs are still up. Landscaping's in it. starting to regrow, take over again. to anyone back here. Just videoing. Just taking the memories away. I'm surprised these sign the sign's still up. I wonder if we can look in through the window. Yeah, you can't see much. Really dark, long hallway. Probably won't be able to see anything back here, but hey, you never know. Could be the dumpster still. I know around the corner is the uh, Circuit City receiving. Maybe there's a window we can look that way. Not much back here. Carpet. The door's taped up. Busted up shopping cart. I wonder why they tape these doors up. It's just duct tape. That's weird. Oh. Kind of cool since that we came back here. Look at all this stuff, huh? Clarence Blast. Might have been some good useful stuff, but compactor someone decided to uh, start on fire. Oh yeah. PlayStation 2 game. Yeah, they're not in there. Crazy mess though. Of course, someone's got to dump off a TV. They always got a TV. Circuit City Installation Center. Likely this is probably where they'd put like your old school mobile phones in your car, your stereos, speakers. It's kind of cool. Old 
pouch out here. That's that's actually propane gas for the sushi place that is still open. Bingo. Doors locked. Pretty pretty neat, man. Some old school Circuit City. I said, drop a comment. When Circuit City closed down, I, I don't remember. Was it in the 2000s? Really, nothing back here. Can't see into anywhere. This must be Circuit City receiving. The compactor is gone. But someone decided to drop off an office chair. Yeah, there's a way into the store, but they got a door up there. Can't get in through the compactor chute. I want to go in anyways. That would be trespassing. More abandoned garbage. Let's wander up. Could use a TV or two. Yep.